Welcome everyone, I'd like to show you how to easily install AppSync on your iOS 14 device. And what AppSync allows you to do is it allows you to essentially install revoke tweet apps and open revoke tweet apps and it works whenever, right? Doesn't matter which certificate you're using, unlike FF Apple, you don't need to go into a proxy. It's just seamless and it's incredible, right? And obviously you will need to be jailbroken with the iOS 14 jailbreak. You can jailbreak no computer up to 14.3 at the time of recording. And you can jailbreak with computer on the latest iOS 14.4 and potentially even iOS 14.5 as well. So if that sounds interesting to you and you want to jailbreak your phone and you want to get tweet apps no revoke, uh, via AppSync, then check out the tutorials in the description down below. And so once we're jailbroken, what we want to do is we want to open up Cydia. Uh, we'll just wait for this to load. And what we're going to do is we're going to tap on Sources. And then we're going to find Edit, Add. And we're going to type in the source or repo, um, which you're going to see on screen. I probably will forget to put it in the description. I might remember, so you might get lucky. Or you can just type it out. It's really easy. So it's Cydia dot akami so just check that spelling because it's a weird word dot ai right so sidia dot akami dot ai we're going to tap on add source and we'll just wait for this process to do its thing all right so thankfully sidia has been improved so this doesn't take five minutes like it used to do i remember when you used to install jailbreak tweaks it used to take 20 years uh but it seems like sam binger maybe use cool stars fork i don't know i don't want to get into conspiracies uh let's proceed with the tutorial so what we're going to do is we're going to tap on search i'm going to search out for app sync so app sync and you want to find app sync unified now if you have multiple repos so this is the hyi repo i think this is the Kima repo you just want to make sure you're downloading app sync unified from the official current repo so if you tap on the repo you should see current repo and you should see your device type is compatible right if you see this this means you are on the right version of app sync let me show you the wrong version you can see it looks like this right um, so just make sure you have current repo right here and once you've done this we're going to tap on modify install confirm and now AppSync should install onto my iphone now it says important no we're just going to tap on okay i understand and then restart springboard and so what that important note that i just skipped said is you need to restart your iphone in order for AppSync to work so it seems like the brand new uh, update for ios 14 has issues initializing AppSync. so what we're going to do is we're going to restart our iphone so we'll just power off the phone now keep in mind uh, make sure before you restart if you jailbreak no computer you go into alt store and you make sure you have your version of uncovered jailbreak properly signed otherwise you're gonna not be able to re jailbreak for quite a while i've already done all my precautions um i have uncover signed 365 days on my iphone i have um another certificate seven days on my ipad you know i honestly think it's really cool that alt store exists personally um the no computer like error nine issue um is is more prevalent than before as well um so one thing you need to keep in mind now is once you jailbreak the no computer you're going to have to use alt store in order to, to uh, update your uncover jailbreak the reason why is because uncover version 3.0.2 and version 3.1 completely block you from jailbreaking their computer now the reason why is because um none of the stores use elder to resign their apps um but i'll be looking into that fix i'll let you guys know um i'll make an updated tutorial once that's all sorted but it's a lot of work and I don't, i'm not really that, that involved in this community anymore so i don't know maybe i'll look into it i probably won't know so what we want to do is we just want to re jailbreak our phone and i use uncover version 4 because there's no phone rebel ads look how fast that was four seconds right okay and obviously it doesn't matter what um uh, uncover version you're on even if you're on the earlier version six versions although i do recommend you update to uncover version 6.1 i've done that on my uh, ipad pro 2017 which is running ios 13.7 and i will say substitute version 2 and uh, uncover incredible jailbreaking experiences right so what we want to do is after we've uh, read jailbreak, we just need to wait for this process to do its thing. I remember uh, on cover version four, in the early versions of version five had this annoying thing where like the Apple logo takes a year to show up. I don't know why. It, I don't know why it does that. The reason why I haven't switched to version six is because it still uses the old exploit, and the old uh, jailbreak exploit is horrendous. Let me tell you that. And the problem is when this exploit fails on my phone, it boot loops my phone, and so I need the best, you know. 
our exploit success rate, and that's what Uncover version 4 provides. So once we jailbroke them, uh, again, what we're going to do is we're going to get our apps from AppSync, right? So really, you can use any third-party store. So for example, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you a tutor box for jailbreak. So we'll just go to Safari, and we'll go, well, look, COVID Cases UK. Um, the one thing um, you need to be a case of is smashing the light button. <laughs> Anyway, that was horrible. This smash like, okay? Horrible jokes means smash like. And also subscribe. I was looking at my thing. 50% of the people watching this video right now are a returning viewer, but 90% of the returning viewers don't subscribe, right? So what this means is 10% of the people who watch my videos constantly are actually subscribed. So if you're, if you're watching my videos constantly, just press the subscribe button, right? Uh, Dr. Tamar Proust. So what we're going to do is we're going to tap on risk revokes, close out of any redirects. If you're redirected to any page which isn't Tutorbox, you have to close out of it right away. And so we have Tutorbox for jailbreak, so we'll tap on this, install. And, um, okay. So it seems like we might actually have to reinstall AppSync Unify because you saw the download just failed. So we will reinstall. There we go. And, okay, so... I reboot my device and didn't fix. That, that was kind of cool. So we'll just reinstall it. And you know what's really funny? It's that the older versions never had this issue, which means that the person broke the, the, the tool. Come on, this work for this video. There we go. Okay, so it seems like uh, the reboot did nothing. Uh, instead, you just have to reinstall apps and unify. So they say, oh, reboot. No, you just need to reinstall. So there we go. We learn something new every day. Am I right? Smash like. So you can see, Tutorbox of Jailbreak has installed. And I do recommend you use the... Um... Actually, no, I just threw this. Anyway, ignore what I was just about to say. Um, yeah, so what we're going to do is we're going to get our applications. So what should we get, right? I'm feeling like Delta. So we'll just tap on get, install. And, um, yeah, I mean, the apps are going to fully work. And also, if you want to use App Valley, because they have 3,000 apps on their library, we'll go to App Factor. No, we'll just use the, um, oh, I'll just show you this. Now, they'll all be in the description, by the way. Um, the links in the description give me uh, a bit of extra uh, commission, right? It's not like you have to wait 50 years or click on these ads or install apps from the App Store. You just wait five seconds and then press go to site and uh, help support the channel. And uh, yeah, so what we want to do with uh, our valleys, because you can see the site glitches, we want to go to landscape mode. And uh, it seems like it's still glitching. I think we need to remove the ads, so we'll just... Uh, so we'll just tap on this ad, close out of here, close out of this, okay. Close. And uh, yeah, okay. So we'll get out some other applications, or the other color version 6 as well. <sighs> it broke, lovely. Oh, there we go. So we'll get INDS. So remember, if you're redirected to any page which isn't INDS or uh, App Valley, or literally any redirect, you just have to close out of it. So let's get INDS on my phone. And you can see Delta's fully working. And um, let's have a look at App Valley. Ah, INDS is fully working as well. So, I mean, these stores are revoked by the, uh, right now, by the way. Um, Apple did a revoke wave and they revoked the science certificate and also all the F of Apple certificates, right? That doesn't matter with AppSync, because it works with literally anything, right? It fake signs the apps, which means it's literally impossible uh, for the install to fail, unless you need to reinstall AppSync. So, um, yeah, hopefully this video helped you out. Um, you can use literally any other store, um, so like Zeus, for example. Um, let's close out this. Eclipse. Okay, well, that's not a third-party app. Maybe Delta. I think I'll have to delete my old delta so i'll just do like this and uh, let's see seems like they're using um no i'll keep that to myself that's the uh archive so yeah everything's gonna fully work um and hopefully this video helped you out if it did make sure to smash like subscribe if you're brand new and um yeah i'm gonna, I'm gonna do a double upload for the next couple of days i'll probably run out of video ideas um honestly man i'm gonna say this for the subscribers who kept on watching to the end this is the most stale jailbreak release in my entire life, right? And I'm not saying this isn't impressive. I think this is an incredible release. But the interest in it is horrible. Like, truthfully, there was more interest in the iOS 12.2 jailbreak release. And that released when iOS 12.3.1 was out. 
you know, with this jailbreak, only a 14.4 is out, so it's like, I don't know what happens. Maybe because it was such a sudden release, because the uh, team was so quiet, but... Oh, they... Okay, there you go. So there's a Delta, and, um... Yes, that's just my personal opinion. I'm not very motivated, because it's just... Uh, it just feels stale to me. Maybe you're excited on the... Uh, I install, like, four tweaks on my phones nowadays. Usually I would install, like, 50. That's why I haven't done a top tweaks video, because... I can only think of five that I actually think is good. Nowadays it's just crap. So yeah, see you guys later. Bye-bye.